Telling you good afternoon, it's probably no surprise anyone wanting to do a movie about the life of Elvis Presley, that they would come here to the Elvis Presley birthplace, and that is exactly what happened with a couple of the major players involved in the Elvis film that's going to be released nationwide on Friday. However, the timing of that visit may be a bit surprising. Director Baz Luhrmann showed up here one day unannounced, along with the star of the film, Austin Butler, the actor who is playing Elvis Presley in this film. According to the assistant director of the birthplace, that visit happened in September of 2019. They spent the day around Tupelo shooting some footage, just getting the feel of Tupelo. Uh, they came out here, they did the tour, they walked the grounds. Rhonda Lamb says when those two left the birthplace and left Tupelo, they were actually on their way to Australia to start filming. But keep in mind, that was September 2019. Then the early part of 2020, the COVID-19 pandemic hit, which pretty much shut down a lot of things, including the motion picture industry, even shut down filming on this film for about six months when Tom Hanks came down with coronavirus. Well, they were able to get filming back going again. And, of course, as we talk right now, folks, gradually making their way back to movie theaters. And we expect some folks will be showing up at theaters across the country when this film makes its formal debut. Now, how do folks here at the Elvis Presley birthplace, the folks who run this attraction, how do they think the new film will affect them? You will hear from the executive director in a live interview on WTVA 9 News at 5 about that for now. We are live in Tupelo. I'm Craig Ford, WTVA 9 News.